In this video I show you how you can connect the DaVinci Resolve Speed Editor to your computer via Bluetooth so you don't have any wires around. You really all you need is a Bluetooth adapter and it has to be a low energy supporting type of adapter and especially it has to be Bluetooth 5.0 or higher. This adapter I got it actually works great and I have another adapter Bluetooth adapter that is Bluetooth 4.0 and that one doesn't work so make sure you get a 5.0 Bluetooth and that also supports low energy mode once you do that you will see the Bluetooth adapter in your device manager if you need to update drivers but usually these things they just work without anything you will see the Bluetooth option. To see the Bluetooth devices, you can go into settings. And also, Windows Update you, it might help you with the optional updates to get drivers for your Bluetooth device. Usually, they come with a CD. The one I have came with a CD. But a CD in this year is not really something to use. So, yeah, the Bluetooth is available. I can turn it off and on. In settings you have the Bluetooth and devices and to add the DaVinci Resolve Speed Editor to pair the Speed Editor with your computer you have to turn on the Bluetooth and add device add Bluetooth device and then wait for the Speed Editor to show up it might not show with the right name and this might be because the device, the speed editor is in uh, sleep mode. If the speed editor is in sleep mode, it will need to be waken up. You see, there is no lights on the snap and the jog button. You press the cut and smooth cut at the same time and also timeline and source at the same time. And those two lights will show up on the keyboard and you can then connect to it as any other Bluetooth device and now they are connected any movement i make on the jog wheel here it will show on the screen on the davinci resolve studio 18. this is davinci resolve studio 18.1.2 and look it's working the main thing is when you press the shuttle and scroll buttons the light will move from from the middle to the left or right, then you know DaVinci Resolve is opened and it's ready to go. This will not work unless you have DaVinci Resolve Studio opened and once you have that, you can use it. It's really nice and easy. You can even use this while laying in bed, literally. I mean, literally, you can lay in bed and use this. Yeah, the speed it works. The battery lasts about a week, I believe, if you use it a lot. But I, I still didn't. Um, I still have it on about ninety percent, and I didn't didn't charge it. And it's been a few days. The main reason to get the speed editor really is this jog wheel that is a uh, jog wheel. It's really precise movement from the wheel to the screen. Thanks for watching. Let me know in the comment section below if you have this and how you use it.